go ahead. Okay. All right. So to thread the machine, we need to open the top of the sewing machine, and then on the spindle, we're going to take this off and put the spool of thread on. Okay. Then this goes back over the spool, holding it in place. Then we're going to come around this knob and just take the thread, come around here. Then I'm going to go down the front of the machine and I'm just going to come down the right hand side, go back up the left hand side, and then this lever here needs to be at the top position. There's a knob on the other side of the machine, a hand wheel, that you turn towards yourself to make that move. Okay. So as long as it's up in the air, then I'm going to take the thread around it. And the trick to this is if I hold on to the thread back here and pull, it will take it right into the spot where it needs to be. I can even open the front of this up so that you can see that it needs to go in this hole right here. Okay. Then I bring it back down again. It's still down in that same slit that we went up. Then I'm going to come around the thread guide. It's a little hook right there at the top of the needle. Okay, And then the thread is simply just threaded straight through the needle from front to back. Maybe. There we go. Okay, And that is half of threading the machine. The next step, that's the top thread. You need to have a bottom thread to make the seam hook together. And this is a bobbin. And we need to put the bobbin in the bottom of the machine, but it has to go in the right way. If you set the bottom bobbin down and pull on the thread, it should turn in a counterclockwise direction. Okay. There's also a picture right at the top there which shows the thread coming off the direction it needs to, to have it going the right way. We're going to flip this little switch here, and it pops the lid off the bobbin sits right down in there and then there are two slits right here and there. The thread needs to come in this slit and pull until you hear just a slight click and be in that position. The last thing to do is take the needle thread that you've just threaded, hold it towards you with your left hand. You take your right hand on the hand wheel and again always turning it towards yourself you're going to take it down until the needle goes all the way down and comes back up to its top position. Then you're going to lift up on the thread that you had in your left hand and you'll see a loop appear. That's your bobbin thread. Then you simply just pull the bobbin thread out. You go ahead and put the lid back on the bobbin cover. Tuck your threads back off to the side out of the way and your machine's threaded.